what's going on YouTube? Welcome to another episode of Collecting on a Budget. I am your host Seth, and on this week's episode, we are diving into collector boxes. That's right, folks. The Marvel Collector Core Avengers Endgame box. So this is a subscription-based box from Amazon that is $29.99 a month, and it always comes with a pop, um, t-shirt, and a bunch of miscellaneous items as well, too. So I'm super excited to crack this open, so let's go ahead and dive right into it. So with these boxes, it's always cool because they always have um, artwork on the boxes. So you can see Iron Man's logo, Black Widow, Captain America, Ant-Man, um, Thor, Thanos, the Infinity Gauntlet, a bunch of other stuff too. And then of course you can see it's got Endgame, Marvel Collector Core on both sides, and then on the back just where it's made. So we all know where stuff's made these days. So let's go ahead, take the trusty box cutter, give it a good slice, and let's open it up. So they already show us when you open it up, you can see the t-shirts covering up, but what they do show is what next month's theme is going to be, which is Spider-Man Far From Home. So that's really cool, so looking forward to see what kind of special stuff goes in there. So first out of the gate, we've got the t-shirt which is always my favorite and I love t-shirts so let's open this up <clears throat> and thankfully it's my size so it is a t-shirt I could wear which is really cool so for those of you that, that haven't seen Endgame again spoiler we're way past the point of no return deal with it so here is the show you guys the fat Thor sitting on a chair you got milk soda chicken wings you know all kinds of stuff so really cool t-shirt like this a lot I love the t-shirts that they put in these boxes because obviously it's Funko based and it makes me happy because we all know I'm a Funko fanatic then next up we've got um, a coaster set which is pretty cool so it is a coaster set of Thanos and Iron Man. So as you can see there, we've got Thanos' face, which is pretty cool. It's a little, little rubbery, but it is definitely super cool. And we've got Iron Man. They had to put something Iron Man related in this box. If it didn't, it was going to be a disappointment. So I'm glad, you know, at least something in there is Iron Man, which is really cool. So, I don't know. These coasters are pretty neat. I'll use them. They will get used, people. And then there are two pops in the box. So the first pop is Valkyrie. So I'm surprised they did this. Um, she didn't really have that major part or that major of a role in the movie. Um, I know a lot of people were hoping that it would have been um, Iron Man with the uh, with the Infinity Gauntlet, but you know we can only we can only do they can only do what they want to do. Hopefully they're saving that and that might be like a con exclusive because we know San Diego Comic Con's right around the corner, so that could be possibly be a con exclusive, but. Here is Valkyrie in her setup, and she's got her daggers and everything, which is uh, which is pretty cool. So, boom. And then last but not least, I saw this earlier. I was super excited about it. And, of course, you all know me being the Captain America fanatic that I am. We've got Captain America wielding the hammer and the shield. Super cool. Um, it's funny because they actually have it in reverse. The shield technically should be in the right hand and the hammer should be in the left hand. But hey, who am I to argue with this beautiful of a pop? So again, really cool. 
Captain America with Minor and the shield. So that is all that they put in there for this month's box. And all right, guys, and thanks for joining me on another awesome episode of Collecting on a Budget. If you guys like what you saw, please be sure to give a thumbs up. If you're new, please be sure to subscribe. As always, be sure to hit that bell so you get notified every time another episode of Collecting on the Budget goes live for your viewing pleasure. As always, you can check out all the excellent content we offer at mcecentral.com. There you can find the collecting news, marvelous statues, statue fanatic, that geek show, comic chat with Chad, what's popping, and of course this, collecting on the budget. So next time, guys, keep it marvelous.